Hi friends, welcome to day 13 of Advent. Today's Advent is another viewer question and today's question comes from Natalie Locke and it is should there be trigger warnings on adult books? I'm gonna take this one one further. I think there should be trigger warnings on all books. I feel like having a page either universally at the front or the back of the book so that people know where to look front or back. I'm even okay with it being in the back. Like if we all know that there's going to be a trigger warning section at the back of the book so if you want to skip it you don't have to worry about accidentally looking at it because it's at the back of the book. Totally cool with that. I feel like even if they're just vague so that you're not necessarily spoiled for what's going to happen in the book. Cool with that. I highly think there should be trigger warnings in all books. YA, adult, children's books. Um, some children's books are fucking terrifying. Have you guys like read Bridge to Terabithia? Do you know what happens in that book? It was horrible. I sobbed like a baby. It's a fucking children's book. There should have been a trigger warning for that book. 120%. Am I the kind of person who needs trigger warnings? Not necessarily. Um, I can read pretty much anything. I don't really have any past trauma that makes things just like go crazy for me. But there are times where there are things that I'm not in the mood for, like the end of Bridge to Terabithia. And it's probably a good idea I not read that at that time. So, you know, I deal with depression. Sometimes I don't want to read books where lots of people die or there's a lot of gore and blood and guts. Can we get some trigger warnings on some shit? Like it's not that difficult. Let's do it. I don't feel like it's that hard. I know some people are like, I don't want trigger warnings because then the book will be spoiled for me. If the top of the page says trigger warnings involves spoilers and you read it, you're a moron if you don't want spoilers. That's on you. So, so yes, adult books, trigger warnings, YA books, trigger warnings, children's books, trigger warnings, put them everywhere. Can we just, just a page? with trigger warnings. Can we get that? 100% trigger warnings. All books. Need them. Should be there. Okay, lighter note. Day 13. It's Creator Spotlight. Let's do it. Today's Creator Spotlight is Angelica Renee. Angelica is primarily a booktube channel but she also does bullet journaling so she's reading and journaling and those things together. She does a lot of the YouTube basics, so TBRs, hauls, wrap-ups, but she also does bullet journaling type spreads to go along with that. She also does art. She has does a lot of art in her bullet journal, but also just does art in general. So if you like different art channels or if you like booktube channels, check Angelica out. She'll be linked in the description box below as well as in the cards for you to peruse. That's going to be it for me today. If you don't want to miss anything I have going on in the future, make sure you subscribe. And until then, I will see you guys next time. Bye!